My name is Mohamed Wahizi and I'm from DP2. As we all know, the 2nd of February is World Wetlands Day and th this year's theme is about uh, Australia's bushfires. Uh, it marks the anniversary of the signing of the Convention on Wetlands of, Impor of International Importance. World Wetlands World Wet Day is to remind us that um, there are many species and uh, ecosystems uh, that have been destroyed due to human action. So it is to tell it is to tell us that it is to inform us that. Um, there are different um, species, ecosystems, and different animals, different plants, and different um, natural resources like um, the temperature and the water and the oceans and the rivers that are uh, live, that exist all around the world. And it is to give us information about these, about how each wetland is formed and how each wetland is important to the world and to humans. And wetlands are really important for animals. The flooded valley is a part of the distinct ecosystem. Wetland is like a, a forest filled with water. The, and most of the animals in the earth live there. And most of the like dangerous poisonous plants are in the wetlands parts. Wetland has most of like the animals in the world and most of the wetlands are being destroyed and forests. I'll give you one example like the Australian bushfire. It is caused by our human action. Basically wetlands are uh, places with shallow waters and plants. Um, so wetlands go by many different names, like for example our project. Wetlands can be at least nine types and wetlands are part of our ecosystem and there's one like type of wetland called ponds and they're all, you can see them every day and wetlands are always connected to nature. Do you know wetlands? Are, go are dying much more faster than forests, 10 times more faster. We should protect the wetlands because the animals are dying. We should not throw trash. My mother is in Yuan and she is trying to protect the wetlands. Hi, my name is Issa and I'm, from, I'm a student from MYP4 and I'm going to be talking about biodiversity. So biodiversity is the foundation of ecosystem services to which human well-being uh, well is intimately linked. No feature of Earth is more complex, dynamic, and varied than the layer of living organisms that occupy its surfaces and its seas. And no feature is experiencing more dramatic change at the hand of human, hands of humans than this extraordinary, singularly unique feature. So my name is Sestan and I'm from MYP4. And so today is World Wetlands Day and we've all made projects to celebrate this and mine is based on biodiversity and it shows the different animals that you can find on earth and how they differ from each other and yeah that's pretty much it. No, my name is Anas and I'm from MYP1. This is a project about wetlands. So as you can see in this project here is like the animals um, of wetlands. I'm from MYP1 and this is my project about wetlands so uh, basically there's the sand in a pond and like uh, an animal like uh, a bird like going up yeah thank you my name is Renaho and i'm from myp1 and this project basically shows like different types of uh, birds in a wetland Hello, my name is Yamuna, and I'm from MYP1, and we also made one um, chart paper about wetland. wetland. My name is Samir, I'm from... Uh, <laughs> my project is basically about like the smaller aspects of life, like um, stuff that most people wouldn't consider, like insects and whatnot. Hi, my name is Zara. Please hold it I'm up. I'm Kainat. And we're from MYP Year 4. And the topic we had was World Wetlands Day, and to further develop it, it was biodiversity. As you can see, all the images that we did discover were very different, 
and in our own words, biodiversity meant a large range or scale Good of Good morning, my wetlands. name is Lilia and I'm in uh, DP2 grade 12. So today is World Wetlands Day and my project is a 3D model of a pond. I have chosen to make a pond because I believe that ponds, uh, which are small water um, sources, are the ones which are the most affected by the climate change. And, Although we do not consider much its biodiversity, it is pretty much uh, very important uh, for us and for the environment we live in. My name Thank is you. Amir. I am from grade 9, am I before? Um, I made a 3D model uh, for the Wetland Biodiversity Day. And uh, this part is nature and this part is water. The reason both are important is because there is climate change and uh, fishing and which affect the fishes because, for example, the pollution that goes into the ocean, it like can kill the fishes. And uh, for example, the Australian bushfire is killing the forest. Wetlands yeah. is very critical for the ecological processes that are carried out. The contribution that wetland uh, biodiversity has on environment, society, and even economy uh, is uh, unappreciated. And for uh, this unappreciation in the history, uh, in 1971, uh, on 2nd February, this day was made Wetlands Day to highlight the contributions made by the environment. Hello everyone, my name is uh, Mohamed Benes and I'm in DP2. So basically this is our project, it's uh, about uh, wetlands and here we have displayed a swamp. Uh, you can see these specific animals which, are, uh, actually, which actually inhabit the swamp. Uh, the wetlands are basically areas that are intermittently covered with water, with shallow water. And uh, we have tried to highlight the biodiversity here too. Wetlands help control the floods and diminish drought. And the types of animals in a wetland that we have displayed here are pelican, rat, snake, and uh, uh, swamp rabbit. My name is Ayana and I'm from DP2. Uh, Wetlands Day occurs on the 2nd of February and is celebrated annually in order to raise awareness uh, about the importance of wetlands uh, to humanity and our planet. Good morning, my name is Ines and I'm in DP2. Today is World Wetland Day, celebrated on February 2nd. So we have seen different projects regarding this aspect. So basically my project is um, uh, a chart with, in which I have written on it the World Wetland Day. I find this day very important because climate change is one aspect which is in which the planet is facing. For example, um, different species in the oceans and different um, ecosystems, they're dying because of this and they're disturb disturbing the balance of the, and the equilibrium's balance. So this is creating huge problems. So this, uh, so celebrating Wetlands Day is very Hot important. And I'm from Thank you. MIP2. Uh, I appreciate our school celebrating uh, celebrating the Wetlands Day as it brings back uh, meaning to it, and it teaches us to stop all these human actions that are destroying our natural um, environment. So uh, I've added less um, natural things because I wanted to show that all because of our pollution and all these things that are happening around the world are like destroying these animals. So we should save more animals and stop polluting more. Good afternoon. Thank you My very much. Now and I'm from MYP2 and today is World Wetlands Day and I showed um, the biodiversity of it.